Hi, this is Brandon with Android Device and Tutorials. Here I'm going to do a quick overview of your engineering hub. Um, kind of an overview tutorial, um, kind of show you everything that it does. Um, info, all it does is show you your current level and just says the engineering hub can complete uh, enhancements and upgrades to ship weapons and defenses. Now this area only um, increases the specific ship that you add an item to. Um, so let's go ahead and tap it again. Upgrade. As you upgrade, the engineering hub, you can increase the level of all of the equipment that you attach to your ships. Um, and of course that's based on player level um, and takes a good bit of time once you start getting up past level 10. Okay, so let's go ahead and go to function and get into the actual hub itself. Okay, first thing you can see is that it has each of your ships so you can cycle through them to see all of your ships and what they actually have equipped, which is this down here. Um, different ships, depending, have different types of equipment. Most of your ships, you'll notice, have will have the same equipment because you're going to be using a lot of the same ships. But <clears throat> first you will have your um, cannon, some type of cannon. Um, here you can unload it or you can enhance it. If you enhance a specific item you can come over here and you see its current level and its current stat. So the, the amount of attack that you get. You can auto enhance and what that'll do is if you have enough cubits it will enhance that to the max for your particular level. Um, right now I think the max I can do is, is level 50 on equipment um, because my hub is not upgraded high enough to go any higher than that. Um, enhance will just go one level at a time. There's also upgrade. Okay, You will find prints as you attack. Um, well, you can buy them with credits and, and get them in the shop. Or you can actually get them from fighting battles with um, elites, which I can show you in a minute. Um, when you upgrade using these prints to a whole new um, weapon, it increases your stats drastically. Um, and as you can see here, though, it requires a certain player level to be able to use plans of a certain level. Um, upgrading will enhance it a lot further than the actual enhancements. Okay, So you have your weapon, which is your attack or your E attack or whatever. Let's see if I have another one here. I believe. Yep, here we go. Okay. See, this, this guy uses this proton, the proton cannon here, and this is... E attack because that's what she actually uses. Um, so she has a different weapon than the others. Um, for the most part, these will be the same. This is your armor um, to enhance um, your defense. This is a photon kit that increases your special attack. That's your proton core. Increases your speed and your health, your hit points. And this is your S defense, which is the defense against special attacks. Okay. Um, the other thing you'll notice in this area is the little up arrow that just keeps going. Here you can um, augment. So here you'll see he's a, a plus zero. You can make him plus one, which increases a lot of his stats. And here's this will show you the increases to the stats that you'll gain. Um, now, these stats, to gain these stats and to actually upgrade him, like in this case he's a ranger, go to the augmentation bay, you will need 100k cubits, and you'll need chips. These chips are going to change based on the, the type of ship that he is. He's a ranger, so he requires ranger chips. Um, I don't have enough there to actually increase him, but okay, since he's a ranger, that's what he uses. Uh, let's look at this one. This guy is a protector, so he would use protector chips. Now how you get chips are from special events. Um, I believe this is the whole area here to kind of explain everything. You'll also see their um, level and their force for each one of your ships. But now, Pandora, when it opens and you can run these events, you actually, as rewards, get chips. And each event, each time Pandora opens, it's a different chip that it has for rewards. Only one type of chip per event. Um, and that's how you'll get those to do that, the great augmentation. 
Um, now, I told you I was going to show you how you get those prints. Over here in the conservatory, when you attack these elites, the, um, they will give you prints as loot. Um, the higher the level, the higher the loot, or the higher the level of the print. Um, since my, all of my weapons are level 50 or better, well, over level 50, I'm going to want to stick with the latest um, area and only attack these for those prints because you really don't need the lower level prints anymore because you already have your weapons up to that level. Um, and they don't give you a whole lot of experience, um, so it's not worth wasting your attacks on. But that's the engineering hub. That's kind of an overview tutorial of how it all works. Um, if you have any other questions or I missed anything, just leave it in the comments of this video. Thanks for watching.